everyone! Welcome back to our channel! Did you hear that guys? That is our topic for today which is wild weather. Did you know what is wild weather? Basically, wild weather is a phenomenon that will cause damage, serious social disruption, or loss of human life. Since nature is always moving and changing, wild weather has happened in different ways. For instance, through natural phenomena that occur regularly, such as rain, winds, earth tremors, and the natural processes of soil erosion. These natural phenomena have effect almost the entire earth. The topic that we are going to talk for today is tsunami. Tsunami is one of the causes that because of weather events such as squalls, thunderstorm, tornadoes, and anything that causes a sudden changes of atmospheric pressure. The word tsunami itself is a Japanese word, which is harbor is a su and wave is a nami. A tsunami is a giant wave which was caused by a sudden movement of the ocean floor due to the earthquake. Did you know that tsunami can travel at a speed of about 500 miles per hour which is almost as fast as a jet plane? Tsunami is not just one wave but it is a wave of a tree. Whenever the tsunami is near to the coast, it will slow down the speed and increase in height. There are two common countries that usually landed with tsunami, which are Indonesia and Japan. Let's not forget about the history of the deadly tsunami that happened in Sulawesi, Indonesia. On 28 September 2018, powerful tsunami has landed in the city of Palu. The combined effect of the earthquake and tsunami have led to the death of an estimated 4,340 people. Indonesia has experienced an earthquake every day, but the scale of the quake and tsunami that hit Palu was considered as a big surprise for them. While in Japan on Friday 11 March 2011, a magnitude 9 earthquake have shook northeastern Japan which unleading savage tsunami or it also known as the 2011 Tohoku tsunami earthquake. It was the most powerful tsunami ever recorded in Japan. The tsunami has swept the Japanese mainland and killed over 10,000 people. Mainly, the victims are through drowning, blown trauma, and caused many deaths. Lastly, for me, I would like to tell you that tsunami can be dangerous and deadly, as we do not have the power to control and to predict because it came from the underwater wave. They have become more dangerous and deadly and makes them more difficult to escape. Tsunami can damage a lot of property and life and usually can cause panic for people. From the book tragedy that we have read just now, it is important not to take this as a light matter. Well, I guess that is the end of my segment for today. Let's hear from what my fellow friend what they are going to share with you guys hope you all enjoy see you soon bye